Tuesday Drive. 25 past six. And what did you think? What did you think of that? It's it's a musical scandal, I tell you. An absolute musical scandal. Ariana Grande ripping off the song from the beautiful Julie Andrews. Or do you think I'm just flipping out over nothing? You think, you know what, Stephen? Chill, man. Chill. You know, Miss Grande, she's got it. She's got it there with her, her BFFs. Actually, speaking of BFFs... um. She says with her song Seven Rings um, that she got the rings for herself and her, her best friends after too much champagne and an impromptu trip to Tiffany's. So, you know, I guess that's what you do, don't you? That's what you do, especially if you're in, the, in Junction Street now, right? And you've had too much of your bubbles. You head to Tiffany's and Junction Street and get yourself a couple of big diamond rings for you and your friends. Anyway, look, I'm sorry. Look, I, I don't mean to be a bit of a prude here, but I'm going to be sticking with Julie Andrews because she's an absolute diva and I love the woman and you just should never touch the sound of music. Uh, speaking of divas, uh, my next guest is being described as Australia's six-foot-something songstress and not afraid to use her height to tower over people to get what she wants. She's a woman who doesn't mind the odd sequin, a little organza around the waist, and some big, big wigs. I'm chatting about the one and only Prada Clutch, and she's bringing her all-star glittery, all-male review to the show Haven with Lay Divas Prada. Welcome to Tuesday Drive. Oh, thank you so much for having me. You just left out the Tiffany ring there. <laughs> oh, did I, oh, you'd like one, would you? Oh, why not? I'd never say no to Tiffany's. <laughs> now, Prada, I look, prefer I, a Prada, that's for sure. Well, I was going to say, <laughs> I, I must confess, I'm actually, I'm a little bit humbled to have you here. My, my hands are getting sweaty because it's, uh, oh. well, I've never spoken to such a big celebrity as yourself on my show before. Oh my goodness! How privileged am I? I know, I know. But no, but believe me, it, 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 the pleasure is all mine. Look, tell me about this little show, Lay Divas. Look, it's tiny. I mean, oh. it's it, it's tidy. It's you know, fifty-four kilos of diamante. Um, it's you know, months and months of planning and and sewing and working bees and all of that. And um, and it's everything you want in life, really. It's colourful. It's um. A diva impersonator, spectacular. Um, I am playing one of my roles is Cher. I, I, I play Cher, and the show is basically Cher and all of her celebrity diva friends. Oh, so, nice! Um, like a reunion. Yeah, so, yeah, it's kind of all the girls that get together and, <laughs> and have a bit of fun, and you know why not? And it's not something that probably has ever happened. You know, having all these big superstars on stage. Um, you know, a, a couple of times there's a few little duets and trios in there that you think, oh my goodness, I didn't know that they've ever done one, and they've they haven't. We've we've created it, we've invented it, we've made it, um, you know, our own, which I think is really quite special, and and giving the audiences a little bit of a little bit of character, a little bit of um, impersonation, and a little bit of glitz and glamour, and a little bit of uh, some some sequence as well, I dare say. Oh, absolutely, there is. So much glitter and sequin and, and diamante and oh, it's just beautiful. As I said, fifty four kilos this show. Um, so have you actually uh, weighed this, much... or are you just making this up? No, that's how much I ordered. Yeah, oh, wow. fifty four kilos you... of diamante. <laughs> yeah. Now... So I know that 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 on top of everything else, you know, um, it's just amazing. It really is. You could you don't even need lights really. You could see the the show from space. I reckon. Oh look, Prada, I, I must. I'm really interested to know. You've got 54 kilos of these sequins and diamantes coming. When it comes to the hairspray, how much do you go through? Oh my goodness! I actually have. Um, I do all the hair in the show, and um, it's another one of my little things that I do. And um, I I go direct to the the hairspray supply. I I was spending a fortune on hairspray, <laughs> you know. Um, and and you know somebody said you know you, there's got to be another way to do it. There's got to be another way to do it. And someone suggested. I don't know if I'm allowed to say it on air, so I won't. But um, somebody suggested something else to use, and I thought, oh, dear, I can't be doing that. So what I did was I went to a supplier and I got cases of hairspray, cases of hairspray. So now I, you know, spray everything. Everything's covered in hairspray. It's fabulous. Does it and cost it smells you, delicious too. Does it still cost you a fortune, even though you're getting it wholesale? 
Oh no! Oh no! The tricks of the trade, darling. The tricks of the trade. Oh, okay. Um, so <laughs> you know people, yeah. obviously, by the sounds of it. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. The suppliers. So um, no, it's good. But it's um, I reckon. Oh God, how many cans of hairspray would I go through? Um, well, in just any one show, you know, at least six, you know, cans. Mm. That's just me. And there's, you know, there's 12 divas, so that, Ooh, it, that is an awful it does lot. get pretty full on. Yeah. Now, look, I've got to confess, I've actually uh, performed at the Shoalhaven Entertainment Centre a couple of times myself. And there are, there's a few dressing rooms out the back, but... There are. I, how, how do you stage the fact you've got 12 huge divas and really you <laughs> don't have 12 huge dressing rooms behind that big stage? No, and the funny thing is, these tw- there's 12 divas being played by three drag queens. So, you know, I can't even sit in my own room with, my- with myself because, you know, I'm having an argument oh. with myself. It's crazy. But uh, what I love about the Shoalhaven, um, the dressing rooms, they've got really big dressing rooms. And, um, you know, I really appreciate that. And you know what? I love to throw everybody in the same room. And, um, I mean, we could all have our own rooms if we wanted, but I like to throw everybody in. You know, not only is it fun, we can, you know, all banter and have fun together and and all of that, but um, it's interesting to see it all unwind with all those divas in one room. You know what I mean? Because everyone gets in their character. You know, from the minute Mm. you sort of get out into the theatre, you're sort of trying to get into your character and trying to really channel that character. Um, so that when you are on stage, it is a complete um, transformation. And as I said, three drag queens, 12 divas, one stage. You know, it's really, you know, to be able to come out from one character and into the next character and, and you know, it, it takes a lot of a, a lot of preparation, a lot of skill and, and um, a lot of talent. And I'm very proud of the girls. They've, they've all um, been able to do that and really shock people mm. you know after the show on saturday i went to the audience and somebody said to me oh were you the beyonce one and i was not beyonce <laughs> not at all but they just honestly just couldn't work out who was who and i thought that was brilliant absolutely brilliant so i mean there's, as i say there's, there's three of you with, with 12 divas that is a heck of a lot of talent tell me have you any, has, yeah. has it ever been in some cat fights in the dressing room before I mean, as a Look, diva. Only when, only when they touch my wigs. You oh, know? Right, no, fair <laughs> enough. Keep your mitts off. <laughs> and, you know, I'll say, listen, you back off, Beyonce, you know, you've got your own hair, go away. <laughs> and, you know, and then I've got Pink, you know, Pink doesn't like too much. Um, you know, she just has a really short hairdo and everything, but she likes to go through my makeup and try and find everything and go crazy. And I said, oh, you better back off, woman. You know, come on, girl, get out of here. So, uh, no, but it's fun, it's fun. We have a little bit of banter and... Um, you know, it's it's just it, we have such a hoot backstage, and then when we're on stage, it's just even you know gets even bigger because it's mm. an exaggeration of what we've all just been having fun in the dressing room and living, and, and then bringing it all on stage. You know, it's it's too far, and there is a bit of cattiness in, between the divas, you know, and um, you know, because obviously Diana Ross, she's got to be the boss, and mm. Barbara oh. Streisand won't have that. She will not have that. You how, know, Barbara how, Streisand. How does she cope with this? She doesn't, mm. and, um, and then she says, hmm, well, you know what? I'm going to do a duet with you. Oh. Come on out, Diana. So then Diana comes out, and they do a duet together, and it's fabulous. You know, it's just so so quirky and so fun, and, and um, the, the audiences are going to absolutely love it. I mean, one of the other nice things about the Shoalhaven Entertainment Centre, of course, is the fact that it is such a large auditorium. So you, oh, could, yeah. you guys would have to have some really big songs to make the most of that. Oh, absolutely. And, you know, the best songs, you know, when somebody thinks of, you know, these these particular divas, you know, I, I, when I was choosing the songs, I thought I need to give the audiences obviously what they want um, with a bit of a twist, with a bit of something different in it. And that's exactly what I've done. You know, um, people expect Celine Dion, they expect my heart will go on. Of course they mm-hmm. do. You know what I mean? So you've got to give them those things. And so I do it, you know, I've done exactly that. But then I've thrown a few other bits and pieces mm. to sort of, you know, give people something different as well. So that it's not just, oh, I went and I saw Celine and she did not my heart will go on. And then I went and I saw um, Shirley Bassey and, and she did get this party started. Or, you know what I mean? Mm. It's, it's giving them what they want, but also giving them a little bit extra. Oh, look, I throw in the kitchen sink, the pantry. I throw everything in. I'm just crazy. <laughs> well, thankfully, there's a, there's a pit in front of you, so if you do throw it, then there's a good chance it's not going to That's hit the right. audience. Members, so <laughs> we'd like to have that safety net there at the Shellhaven Enter Savings yeah. Centre. Hey, Prada, yeah. um, what are some of the songs that you guys are going to be singing? 
Yeah, Are you able to tell us that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not? As I mentioned, my heart will go on. Yeah, of course. Leon. Um, I'm not going to tell you what else she does because it's fabulous. Oh, no. You have yes. to be there for that. Um, but Cher, does, she's doing the classics. She's doing the turn back time. She's doing the believe. Um, she's got an, another couple of other surprises in there that I'm not going to tell you about. You've got to come and see, but some current stuff and some exciting stuff that everybody knows, which is great. Um, you know, Beyonce's doing her, her single ladies and she's doing her crazy in love and Lady Gaga's in there and she's doing, um, you know, the classics, bad mm. romance mm-hmm. and, um, what's the, what's the other one she does? I can't remember something now, but anyway, she, something fabulous and something crazy and it just looks amazing at, um, uh, uh, who else? We got? Barbara Streisand. Oh, wow. Babs doing... herself. Oh, yeah. Oh, Babs is there. She's there. Big nose and Bob <laughs> Wick, and she's all over it. Um, and she's 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 doing um, The Way We Were, oh, as I nice. think, you know, most people would expect. One of my favourites. A... Yeah, and it brings a tear to a glass eye as well, which is quite nice. And um, as well as, um, you know, she does a bit of a, a, a little surprise, and then she does a little bit of Don't Rain in My Parade as... You would expect, oh, so as you would expect. So a real yeah, good mix of, of songs there. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm. You get this party started, mm. and oh, you know, it's 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 so big and it's so fabulous. And as I said, there's a few surprises that you just would not expect, and that's what the the audience have been saying to me. That oh my goodness, that was so wonderful. I was it was there's no way in, in hell would I have expected that to happen. You know, um, oh, Bet Midler's in there, and she's doing everything. Everything she's doing, everything she's so fabulous. Yeah, I'm I'm very excited for everyone in Shoalhaven to see it. We were there recently, I think it was a year ago now, um, with Prada's Priscilla's, um, and we had such a great response. And that's why, I, and I told them all, we'll be back, we'll be back. Um, so we're coming back this, uh, not this Saturday, next Saturday, um, and we will. I, I hope I'm hoping that um, they love this even more than what they did um, the Priscilla show. I've really put a lot of effort into, um, you know, give, give back to, to everybody and I hope they will enjoy it all. So, well, it sound, Haven, look out. It, yeah, it certainly sounds like you've got some, you know, some great songs, you know, that you know, take, oh, yeah. take people down memory lane. So, look, I don't think people are going to be disappointed, but I've just about out of time and I just do have one last question for you, yeah. Parada. Now, look, and I don't mean to stereotype here. No. But divas are renowned to be a little bit difficult in some of their demands. Are you one of oh, those yeah. divas? I am absolutely not one of those. Divas. Right. Wow. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm. I'm. You know, I'm very grateful with with everything that I'm given and everything that you know people do. And I have to actually make a special mention. Last time we were at Shoalhaven, um, the the crew there actually brought us back a lovely bottle of wine oh. that was locally locally. Um, brewed mm. and they gave us a lovely chilly sort of jammy situation and you know it was just a nice little thing that was not expected and mm. i'll tell you what we were so grateful we drank it in the car on the way home and we stopped and got some chips and we dunked it in that chili and we all loved it everyone had a great oh. uh, really 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 wonderful time i mean look if they don't have my flowers there i would like you know 12 long um tulips and if they don't have 12 long stemmed tulips i will be turning but uh, <laughs> I'm only joking. Well, I'm they're listening. Joking, but... At least a nice bottle of uh, wine that's uh, that's come from the Shoalhaven. Yes, and that chili, whatever that chili jam stuff was. Oh my goodness, it was to die for. All right, to well, for, Shoalhaven so. Entertainment Centre, you are on notice. Prada is after yes. some chili jam, some chips, some flowers, or some nice local wine. Yes, whatever you can give. Really whatever they can give her. <laughs> well, thank you so much uh, for joining us this afternoon. And My the pleasure. best of luck. And uh, be, it's going to be lovely to have you back in the show, Haven. Cannot wait and I'll see you on the night. Look forward to it. That is Prada Clutch from uh, one of the divas from Lay Divas. And uh, you can catch them at the Shoalhaven Entertainment Centre on the 16th of February. And we've got 20 minutes to go before the end of the show. And I've got a really simple question for you. And you can actually win yourself two tickets to go and see it. Who is your favourite diva and why? Now, I've got to make it a little bit difficult. And if you are going to call and, and tell me why you like this particular diva... You've got to be prepared to go on air and have a little bit of a chat with me. That is, that's the stipulation. So I've got two tickets to go see the show. Double four, double two, one zero four five. Who is your favourite diva and why? Here's some thinking music from uh, the wonderful Richard Gere, and I think this is very appropriate, with Razzle Dazzle.
At Triple UFM, we understand your afternoon commute. Like you, we live in the Shell Haven. We know you're not allowed to touch your smartphone, so rely on what your car radio is tuned into. At Triple UFM, we get that any disruption on your trip home can affect your travel. We also believe that you would handpick music that's not from a playlist. Oh, Shoal Haven River, what a nice river! And hey, an opportunity to have your say. Hi, I'm Stephen. Join for Tuesday Drive from 5pm on Triple U, 104.5 FM.